hello once again welcome back to my youtube channel in today's tutorial i'm going to show you how to create animated videos like this one for free hello so we're actually going to create something similar to what you can see on my screen and it's actually going to be free i'm going to walk you through step by step how to create your own animated video like this so stay tuned for this and don't forget to subscribe and also don't forget to turn on post notification so you don't miss any of my upcoming video tutorial now let's jump into action we are going to use a platform called animaker so this is the platform we're going to use to create our animation i'm going to walk you through everything step by step so the future of video making starts here so this amazing platform which we're going to use so the first thing we need to do is to create your first video let's click on this now i have already created an account so it just logged me in straight by in your case you have to first create an account okay we have over thousand over ten thousand templates that you can pick from and it's actually for free you can use any of them over here and then we have several characters as well now we want to create our own animation we want to start everything from scratch that is what we're going to do now if you log onto your dashboard this is what you'll be seeing the template that are here cartoon videos video ads you can use any of this template and it's quite very very easy we have the invite video social media videos instagram we have several introduction videos and all those things you can use any of this template to create your video you can just have to edit the content and then you use them but let me show you how you can create your own from scratch and then animate it the way you want so if you come to your dashboard you can easily go to create you just click on that and you can see we have what creates a video creates that's gif that's graphic interchange format we have create a character create a presentation screen recording create voice and then create subtitle and all that but we want to create a video so let's go ahead and click on this i'm going to use a blank page we want to create our own video the way we want so that's what we're going to do so click on blank page and then we want to allow that to open for us so i'm just going to close this video tutorial now this is the blank page of open we're actually going to create everything from scratch if you look at the far left side we have several presets we can use we have the character we have property we have text we have background we have image we have videos and there's a lot you can use for this animation or animated video now these are some of the characters we can include within our animated video some are paid and then some are also free now we first need to add a background to this scene so the first we need to do is to come down here and click on what's bg that's the background and then from the list over here it's going to populate this place for us with a list of background okay as you can see we have list of backgrounds we can use we have business we have education we have nature we have celebration we have travel sports and then in that order so all we have to do is just all we have to do is to pick one of this background and then add it to our scene in order to do that just click on it and then it will add that to your scene for you so that's the first thing we're going to add to our image and then once we are done with that we can also add the character to this background okay so now let's say we want to add a character and we have the character more of that listed over here and we can use any of them let's assume we want to use this character over here just click on that and then it's going to add it to our scene over here we have that's by default you're going to have 10 seconds if you want to reduce the duration of this animation you can click on the minus icon to decrease the time duration or click on the plus icon to increase the time duration now when i click on this it's actually going to reduce it for me you can see i have eight seconds and then in that order so let me just reduce this to let's say five seconds so i'm going to leave it as five seconds we have our first character over here now once you add a character you can apply an action to that character okay so we have over here the action we have we have the sneak walk we have the singing we have the mobile chatting we have searching on map so there are several actions you can add to this we also have expressions over here if you want your character to be happy smiling and all that so if i go ahead and click on smiling let's see what is going to happen 
it's actually going to update this when you play our video this character is actually going to smile then let's try to give this character an action and see how it's going to be like now first let's try and then use what snake walk so look at how this is going to be like now what is going to happen is that we've added a snake walk but this character is actually going to be at one place if we play this it's actually going to be at one place with no movement so we expect this snake walk to move along the screen that's the screen we have over here or the background now this is our scene we can set the time duration for this character so let's see we want to actually make this character move so let's go back to our action over here and in order to make this move we have to go to smart move here and then from the smart move option immediately i add smart move option we're going to see on the timeline we're going to have two actions over here the first one here we can decide to make our objects or the character we can take it off the screen and then when we come to the second option then maybe it can walk over the screen like that and then we can set the time duration for this so we can just move this maybe everything should happen in what just two seconds okay that is what we want to do and then we can click on what apply let's apply this and then see now let's bring our cursor down here from the beginning and then let's play this and see how this character is going to move across the screen so you can see now our character is moving and that's exactly what we expected so we can also set it up to move or walk you can also set it up to actually walk so there are several things you can do there are actions are there you can pick any of this action to work for you and it is exactly as you've seen over here that is what you should be expecting now we can add multiple actions as well if you don't want the characters to just if you don't want the character to move just across the screen you can allow this character to move and then stop along the way you can actually do that and you can also go ahead and add music to the background while this character is moving so this is a typical example of walking character so we want to try the walking and then see so i've deleted the first one i've deleted the first one now let's add a different character and then we want this character to work so i'm going to click on this new character but i actually want this character remember i actually want this character to work but you remember you can actually zoom in resize this anytime you want now we want to apply an action to this and that action is going to be what for this character to work okay it's going to work across the screen and we can actually go ahead and then set up that character so i'm going to select this and it will come to our action over here i'm actually going to wait for this to load okay so I have my actions loaded right here and i'm going to look for what work okay so this is a typical example of working so when i click on this this character is going to work and the same way it's going to be at the same place and if you want this to move we have to go to smart move and then we're going to select what from left to right you can indicate how the character is supposed to move there are some options you have to upgrade to the premium version to get that now you just have to go for your first action and then this should be off screen for the second action let's say this should happen in two seconds so do that and then we drag this to somewhere here now immediately we do that we can bring our cursor back and then play this and then it should be working across the screen okay so we need to apply this first before we play this and then that is it so that is everything is set and then what happens if you want to add a character you want a character to talk remember you have this option over here add a voice over to this we can easily record our voiceover use text to speech upload our own recorded voice so now i want that to use a different action we want this character to move here we are going to use two action not just walk across the screen but walk and then stand somewhere in the middle and then maybe a bit maybe say something okay so i'm going to delete this character now let's start over and i'm going to click on this bring out this character again i'm actually going to use action over here so the first action i want is to sneak first like this okay i want it to sneak like this and then i'll go to action plus so if you want to add multiple actions then you have to use the action plus so i'll click on action plus 
and then the next action i'm going to do is i'm going to click on the plus icon to add a second action okay so the second action i'm just going to indicate what i want this to do so i just want to select a different action so let's say i want to bring it in the table and every other thing here for this object to start doing something so i'm actually going to drag this to the middle so first of all my object or character will move get to the screen get to the office here sit down and then start typing and i want all everything to happen maybe probably within two seconds okay so we go back here let's apply this and then we'll play this and see so look at this you can see it move it got here and then sat behind the table and then start typing okay so it will get here we'll play this again i'll go back let's maybe probably move it to around maybe three seconds so it doesn't move too fast okay so we want every action to happen in three seconds so i'm going to play this again and then it will move gradually when it get there it will sit down and then start typing now that is very amazing you can equally download this and then start using within your project so now if you want to add any sound to this i'm not going to be specific about this it all depends on where you want to add your sound i'm just going to demonstrate to you what you can do with that so that probably i just want to get to my object sitting over here and then let's use the action part so let's say we want to record a voice or use text to speech you can just come here click on this and then use what text to speech or recorded video if we, recorded voice so let's say text to speech so i'm just going to come here and then type so let's say i um let's say ai generated video so that is just a voiceover i want to use and i'm using text to speech you can change it to a male you can change it to a female voice if you want to the english you can change and then select any language at all and we have the voice over here we have the premium one so there are some free version you can use over here so let me just say i'm using karim and then you can play this and see AAMAA generated video okay so you can see if this is not clear you can change it to a different language i think there's another one here AAMAA generated video okay so you can just go through the list and look at which of them will be good for you to use okay i basically said arabic bulgarian that is why i'm getting that but probably if i should go with a language that you understand very well let's say i'm going to use british english and then you can see I have Jack over here. I can use Jack for that. So when I play this, it should be clearer to you. I am AI generated video. So you can see this is very clearer. And then we can add this to timeline. Okay. In the same way you can use a voiceover. You can record it right here and then use. So you can see if I want to play this. I am AI generated video. So you can see this voice has been applied. The same way you can add music to this background while the video is playing so if i come down here and i want to add probably a music i just have to click over here and there are premium version of this music you can see a lot of premium version so i can filter this and then i can get a free version select free and then click on apply filter and this should give me some free version i can actually use with this so when i click it's going to add this to my timeline but that's not what i want to do but once everything is set we are okay with our setup all we can do is to go ahead and publish this video and then download it onto our computer you can add several things like i said we have text over here properties we have images and there's a lot you can do with this i'm going to leave the link to this website at the description of this video and i also have some products over there if you feel like buying that you can actually use that link so that i can get some commission on that and also follow me on my social media links at the description so now let's go ahead and click on publish so immediately you click on publish you can equally share this on social media or youtube or just download this straight so in our case let's try downloading this video so download and then we can select the resolution we want to use i'll just go with the 720p and click on download So actually going to render this video for you first and then you can download it so the video has been processed over here we just have to wait for some time then we'll download it
so now as you can see the video is fully processed so i can just play this my ai generated video so our video is actually playing now and then we can actually go ahead and click on download or share this via email or social media okay basically you can see there's a watermark if you want to do this video without a watermark then you can easily go for ten dollars per month that's for the basic plan and then you can remove the watermark you can still have access to a lot of resources you can click go ahead and edit this view before downloading and you can also duplicate this so let's go ahead and click on download and then download this onto our computer so this video is going to download and then i can use them in any way i want to so i can just go ahead and then open this i am ai generated video so you can see our animation is actually working perfectly as expected we add our own background added our character and that is very simple you can use our platform to do amazing stuff like subscribe for more tips and tricks till i come your way again always visit my channel subscribe